the fishermen win. Oh, well. Nice. Welcome to Lambo! Woo! J. Coach. I like it. Mother Africa. Mother Africa. Come on. Mother Africa. I'm coming home. Welcome to Coop's Corner. Come along for the journey. It's a lifestyle and it's all about learning. I love you, Africa. What's good, everybody? Woo! What's going on, guys? It's your man, Jay Coop. And today, we are headed to Lamu, Kenya. Yes, guys. I'm headed back to the coast, and oh, it feels so good. Currently, I am in Nairobi, Kenya. Now, I'm not gonna lie, it's very chilly here, so I had to hit the coast before I got ghosts. You feel me? We are about to go on an amazing adventure to Lamu, Kenya. This is a very historical place. I've researched that there are no cars in Lamu, Kenya. Transportation is by donkey. That's going to be very different, guys, and I can't wait to take you along for the journey. As I'm going to take you from Nairobi all the way to Lamu, everything in between. Me and you, we're going to experience this together, baby. So we're about to hop on this flight, take that trip to the coast, and experience the Lamu, Kenya. God is amazing. Blessings up, people. Okay, guys, pack your bags and let's head to Lamu. Are y'all ready to go? Yes, sir. If you're new to the channel, there's one thing that I have to say. Hey! Let's get it. We got the big van, guys, headed down to Lamu. Akini! Let's go. Showing you the whole journey, guys. Luggage in hand. She got it, boy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Say hi, Akini. Hello, hi. Are you ready for Lamu? Yep, let's do this. Let's go. <laughs> oh, this is comfortable. Hello. Hey. Hi. Yeah. He said, yeah. So we're going to get to know Akini more. But right now, it. we're headed to go for the Mpesa, right? Yeah, we're going to the Mpesa for some cash. Because but you said Lamu might not be the best place for Mpesa. Because you said that you, you might go to Lamu and not get an Mpesa there. But I'm like, Mpesas are everywhere, all over Kenya. But right, let's go with what you say. You're the boss. These seats are very comfortable. Like I'm happy that I got a, a bigger car. I'm glad you picked this one. Absolutely. Because we would have been like crushed up in this one. Yeah. But guys, it's like a beautiful day and like we're leaving. Like this might be like the nicest day since I've been here. Look at some views in my road. All right, guys, walking to get cash. What is this neighborhood called, Akini? Halingum. Halingum. This looks nice. This Business is... place. Really? Yeah. Okay. Right here? Okay. All right, guys, get this money. All right, guys, we're just waiting now for the agent to get it. So this is how we get the cash. How do you do it on the other side? Like oh, get like money? Yeah. Like just go to an ATM. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is good for people to see. Okay, got a message. Shoot what the message says. Confirmed. Cool. <laughs> it's like a uh, hundred club. Bob and Schilling. <laughs> this is like a dope area over here. Like kind of looks like Americanized, but like it looks busy. Check this area out, guys. Okay, guys. So we stopped to get some food at the grind. So what are you looking at, Akeem? I just want to have some bacon, so I'll go for some samosas. Okay, so she wants samosas. I want pancakes, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. I hope they're good. Okay guys, we are at the airport waiting. The pancakes did not have syrup. <laughs> I ate some of her samosas. Took one. Now we're just waiting. This is like the most boring part of traveling. I don't like it. The sun is out. Ah, uh, look at the sun just beaming on this black skin, guys. We're headed to Lamu. This is going to be a crazy adventure. Miss Akini, what are you most excited about for Lamu? Going to the beach, getting some sun on my skin, and wearing short clothes. Hey, oh, Definitely. she's getting ready. Once the vlog goes on more and more, probably less and less clothes. Peace. I'm about to get on the plane. I'm still hungry, guys. I didn't get no pancakes, man. It's like literally just sitting right on the main. <laughs> it's everywhere. It's here. It's here. You gotta get the apple, guys. You have to choose your poison. That's the poison right there, guys. <laughs> That's the antidote. We don't land at the airport. We call it the clearport. Airplanes everywhere. There's our friend going to Melindy right there. So there's the plane, guys. We another cargo plane, guys, pretty much. Probably no air on there. It's gonna be hot. 
Skyward Express, it seems a little bit more comfortable than Fly 540, I'm not gonna lie to you. At least the seats are like somewhat leather. I'm not shy. I'm just hungry. Me too, man. <laughs> this is the plane, guys. It looks way more comfortable than the Fly 540. You have the seats with at least some, some type of leather on it, you know what I mean? We got like a little bit of space for our feet. I got my bag right here. She's able to kick her feet. Uh, for level ready to order for emergency exit. I can't be How you doing? Good. Cool, I'm special. Okay, guys, we have landed. Let me show you the airport, what it looks like. Let's get the Lamu people. Hi, guys, this is the airport at Lamu. Manda Airport this is what it's going to look like when you land. Okay, guys, no cars, so we have the donkeys doing their them. job. Wow, that's Liddy right there. Now we're getting on these boats. Boats everywhere. Whoa, we got to get in this, guys. This is crazy. Please do not fall. Ah, this is crazy. <laughs> this is Uber. Zero Ubers. Look at this, y'all. This is crazy, man. Living life. Coast to Africa. Oh my God, I'm scared now. Hey. Hey. Okay. <laughs> nice. How you doing? I'm the captain. Good, yes, sir. So, how long is the boat ride? Five minutes for the time. Five minutes, okay. Because we are using a speedboat. Guys, this is the Lamu House Hotel. Let's see what is going on. Okay, guys, so this is your room here at Lamu House Hotel. Let's go check it out. Now we have different names for the numbers. This one is in Dow, and we have a nice seating area right here. This is a very picturesque place if you want to take pictures. Okay, so you walk in. You see these rustic doors, man. This is like crazy the way this is set up. And we have the mirror. What's going on, guys? Right there. Check yourself out before you leave out, you know? We have a nice area right here to hang your stuff up. Very, very rustic, man. Very rustic. And here's the bathroom right here. You have a safe. And you have things like this. Here's your toilet. And here's your shower. Crazy, guys. Look at the architecture in here in the shower oh man you got the giraffes right here very dope seating area you get complimentary coconuts too coconut water and complimentary water you have a fan this is different for me guys i'm not gonna lie like it's no air but you have to experience new things and you have this nice canopy style bed right here very dope and then we're just walking onto the coast of Africa people. This is what we're doing right now. It said that there were no cars on here, but I see a car, but yeah, man, this is it right here. Okay, guys, that is the room here at Lamu House. Once again, this is very different, but open your mind for new experiences. I am very hungry, so let's see what we can grab to eat here in Lamu, Kenya. All right, y'all, let's get it. Donkey's just walking, y'all. Oh, I'm gonna go walking towards me, bro. What the is that? Crazy. Oh, wow. wow. Okay, guys, this is the Lamu Museum right here. Maybe we can go in here one day when I'm here. So this seems like the busy area. Whatever this area is over here looks very busy. So they said no cars, but there's definitely motorcycles out here. This is crazy, y'all. Like, what baby donkey and like a mom, right? Like, this is wild. I'm trying to find some food. It's like a lot of people staring right now, though. Uh, I don't know if we need a guide or not, but We'll be back, man. Hi. All right, guys, headed into Mangrove Restaurant. Okay, guys, food just appears on the table. What is this called again? This is called biryani. Biryani? Yeah, it's um, spicy chicken and spicy rice. From the food to the world, man. That's what we're doing. We had to move where we were sitting at. Try to ask the guy, like, hey, like, can you like clean the table? The guy was just like, the table's already clean, but there were people already over here. So this is different, guys. Lamu, Kenya. I'm gonna let y'all know how this food tastes though. Let me know in the comments below, have y'all had this before? This is good though, right? Yeah, yeah, but it have like a lot of things mixed in it. Mmm. Yeah. All right, y'all, let's get it. Passion drink right here. Let's see how this tastes. Mmm. Would you suggest people come to this restaurant? Yeah, the food is definitely good. You have to let us know how that tastes. <laughs> 
with the ice cream. Yay! Thank you. Santi. Ice cream, man, buddy. I'm like a happy kid now. You have to give them a review on this, so it's good, man. <laughs> Some big boats, guys. Just walking through, man. Minding no business. The baby. Hey, baby donkey. Lamu at night, man. Just chilling. This is life right here. So much more to come. Donkeys, people speaking Swahili, bikes coming down the street. So yes, guys, first night in Lamu was pretty fun, man. I'm not gonna lie. Now we're just relaxing, chilling. I'm gonna show you guys more of the hotel. This hotel is dope. It's like with me, I have to get comfortable with a place first, and then I'm more relaxed. You know what I mean? So Lamu, get ready for J. Coop. Coast of Africa. Africa, Indian Ocean right behind me. God, thank you. I'm truly blessed. I hope that I sparked the mind of someone like my brother sparked my mind when he was sending me all those postcards. I don't know if he knew what he was doing. He sparked me into wanting to travel. So guys, good night. And the next time I see you, it'll be daytime in Lama, baby. Stay blessed, y'all. Bye! Good morning, Africa! Woo! What's going on guys? It is the next day here in Lamu, Kenya. Let's see what the weather's looking like. Ah man, just waking up. This can't be life. You know what I'm talking about? We got the people out early, boats. The tide is kind of low right now. You can see that the water's not all the way there. Look at the beautiful greenery. So yes, guys, time to get this day started. We are gonna be doing a multitude of things today. I'm actually gonna film a separate video today that you guys are gonna see sometime in the future. I'm trying to get some pics for the gram, swagging it out. Let me get a quick heat check. You see the shirt? I call this the beware of the dog, man. <laughs> okay, guys, about to get some breakfast. I'm gonna show you guys everything here in Lamu Kenya, baby. Whew. God is the greatest, and I'm praying in the latest. Aye! This is crazy. This is the culture out here, the Swahili culture. It's a vibe. You just sit back. Woo! Chilling, man. This could be the thumbnail. And this is the vibe right here. You guys can see that greenery right there. Good morning. How you guys doing? I think they're doing good. Great night. Great night. Yeah. We didn't have any mosquitoes, but I'm surprised about that because I expected some. But it was a great night. How do you pronounce this? This is the name of our room. How do you pronounce that? That's Ndao. Ndao. Yeah. Ah. We're going to get some pictures, man. So, so as you see, we have mirrors right here. All of these rooms have different names. Like this is dope though. You got seats, more windows. Just look at the vibe, man. Like this is a crazy vibe out here. Seating area, pretty dope. If this was the purge, guys, that would definitely be my mask. That mask is crazy. Just the scenery, crazy, man. Oh, oh man, they got darts, man. Do you think that you could beat me in darts? I don't think so, but I can try like one or two practice for a few minutes and then maybe I can beat you. Come on, guys, follow me. Okay, now today we're in La Mutini, all right? Beautiful views, live life, you know what I mean? Paradise is everywhere, it's all in your mindset. Live life, be grateful, and thank God for everything. Breakfast time. All right, guys. Here is where breakfast is served. Look at the artwork. So this is where we are. And that's where the airplane comes. Here's the seating area at the moonrise. So here's the menu, guys. We have juice, smoothies, fruit, bread, cinnamon roll, chocolate cake, pancake thing. I can't do it. There's no syrup. Homemade granola, eggs, and an omelet. Guys, the vibe out here is crazy, man. Look at this. This is life right here. Okay, guys. Breakfast came out. Now, one thing you're going to have to deal with is flies. I'm not going to lie to you. You kind of just have to go with the flow. But this is breakfast right here. Everything looks fresh. This drink though is probably like part of like the craziest thing. This is crazy. Since I've been in Kenya, people have been telling me to try Fanta Passion. This is like the real version of Fanta Passion because it has like the pulp in there. You know what I mean? Like this is real. So this is actually good, guys. No lie. This is like an honest review. The eggs are pretty good, but the potatoes, they're hidden, man. I don't really eat like the fried tomatoes too much, so I don't know what I'm gonna do with that, but come to Lamu House. Get the potato for breakfast, trust me. Cheers to Lamu. Make it the best. Job. 
got to get this right, y'all, with the portrait. We're like still trying to get Instagram pictures. It's not easy. Make sure you go like this picture and this picture on Instagram at Jackson. That's cool. Let's go. Buck that donkey. Buck that donkey, baby. Let's go. That's the Lamu house right there, guys. That's where we took all our pictures at. Yep. Look at this. Look at this little cut space up here. Those are uh -huh. the small streets. Oh, those are the small streets? Yeah. I want to like go on one of these streets, guys. Like, we're going to do that later. He just got me hyped. Like, what did you ask him? Where he's going? And uh, if that donkey is his, but he was like too shy to talk to me. And I'm walking in my J's, y'all. Hit that like button. Santi. Very nice handcrafted stuff, guys. Look at this. Handcrafted beds. I haven't seen a happy donkey here. Like, you know the movie Shrek, right? Can I stay with you, please? Of course! Really? Uh oh, here they come. Come on, guys. Kick you, boy. Kick you. They're struggling to work because it's like they've carried a lot of laws in them. They put a lot of work on those donkeys. They should pay them. Three hours later. Okay, guys. We just got done filming the street food video. Make sure you check that out. We're just walking. Miss Akini right here. Those are donkeys. Listen, man. There are donkeys everywhere here in Lamu. I want her to get on one. No, please don't do it because that donkey will kick this <laughs> sh out of here. That donkey gonna kick a hole in her chest. <laughs> Boom! That dog. Oh, I'm scared he's gonna buck me. Is ready to kick too. It's like deserted boat land over here. Guys, you know I gotta give you a motivational talk time. So this is the motivational talk of the day. Whatever you wanna do in life, just do it. There's gonna be a lot of naysayers. You cannot let that stop you from your journey. Your journey is different than everybody else's. You can't let nobody stop you from what you're doing. Always stay focused, always stay committed on your goals and your dreams. Now, it's gonna be hard work that you have to put in, but when you put that work in, it's gonna make sense, it's gonna pay off. Stay blessed. Respect your parents. You can achieve anything you want. I'm not from here. I'm 8,000 miles from home, guys. It's amazing. So we're just about to go back to the room, hang out, catch you guys on the flip side. Hope you're enjoying the video. So much more to come from Lamu. I love it, baby. Let's get it. Should we take a late night dip in the pool? We might. Good morning, Lamu. What's going on, guys? Today is going to be a very adventurous day. We are going to get into some very good things. I want to give you some educational things plus some fun. That's the meaning of Hoops Corner. This skin needs to be in this weather. I don't belong in cold weather. Melanated people need to be in the sun. Message! Let's make it the best day since we've been here. And I want to ride a donkey today. Yeehaw! Let's get it. Give me the green light. Give me one light. Hey. Good morning, sir. Good morning, how are you? Good, good. I'm making a great day today. Yeah, it's gonna be a great day. So right now, me and Mr. Kini are getting breakfast. This breeze feels amazing. Hopefully they have cinnamon rolls. He's about to come out. I think I know what I want. Okay, sure. <laughs> like, can I get the fruit platter? Okay. Please. Cinnamon roll? For today, no. Oh, wow. Yeah. Why do y'all have the cinnamon rolls? Like, y'all didn't have them yesterday up. either. He woke up singing cinnamon rolls. Let me do the bread basket. Okay. And two eggs fried. Fried. Yes. Thank you. So, no cinnamon rolls again, guys. It's just not meant to be. This is to keep the flies away, guys. Let me know in the comments, guys. What's up with Melindy, man? Like, Melindy must be popping. I'm trying to find out how popping it is. You feel me? So, what's been my uh, key word here since I've been here, go? Sasa. <laughs> Sasa. <laughs> Sing Sasa to everyone. Yes. Okay, guys. All dressed and ready to go. It's currently 9.54 a.m. here in Kenya. And it's 3 in the morning back home. But I had to tell my dad happy birthday and I love you. My dad is in his 70s and I want to make him proud. So hit that like button so I can make my dad proud. All right, guys. Let's head out to Lamu and make it do what it do. But... I want to show you guys something. This is something that might make you like this hotel. One, two, double shower. I'll leave that up to your imagination. All right, guys, let's hit the city. Oh! Please do not disturb. They should have, please do not disturb. And you say it should be written, disturb. <laughs> I don't 
The fort costs 600 shillings for two people. I'm gonna show you guys the museum of Lamu. Let's get into it. So this is the trade, guys, the Indian Ocean trade. What's that word say right there? You know what it is. So these are things that they would trade, guys. You have the tusks of elephants, hippos, tooth, shark fins. Very sad, but that's how they were trading and getting things done. Traditional plaster work took many buried in beautiful forms. The most spectacular of all were the wall niches found in the central gallery of the Swahili house. These are sandals, guys. Like, this is crazy. Crazy. You would like put your toe right here. This is the tub right here, guys. Ancient artifacts. It's pretty dope, man. This is where the king was sitting. King on his throne. This is like a temper pedic of like the 1500s, guys. This will probably cost you some bread back in the days. Let's keep it moving. This is like an old school Lamu guitar, guys. This is pretty cool. Like all of the architecture here is very ancient. Like it looks like it looks dope. I like the look of it. So this is the style on the wooden doors that you're gonna see a lot of when you come to Lamu. This is wood. This is iron. Now we're headed up, guys. Oh, that's scary. I thought that was a real person. Holy. My dog right here. So this looks like traditional Swahili food from way back, guys. Do you notice any of this to be familiar to you now, still? This one would be like mandazi and that chapati. So pretty much the same food from now. Yeah. I had to ask the Kenyan lady, is this similar? I mean, because stuff really doesn't change too much. Hey, man. Watch your step. Kitchen utensils. I'm not the best chef, but this is where they would make their dishes. I think I would be super strong if I had to live back in these days. Cause like you had to like do things manually. This is my little boot thing right here, man. She's been chilling for about a thousand years. I told y'all I was gonna be back, man. Why you look all stiff like that? The king is my friend. This is the bridal look that they would have right here, guys. All right, I'll be back. Give me like another thousand years, all right? Go check where you'll be sleeping with your bride. Oh, so that's why she's mad, because I haven't <laughs> been back into the bed. Listen, I haven't been in this bed in thousands of years, guys. The groom will enter this incense-filled room and sleep with his virgin bride. Yes! That's up. You just see the streets, see the people walking. This is a dope bed, though. Like, look how like, high it is off of the ground. You have to put your toe in between that. Ooh. Ooh. Could you do that? No, I can't even walk with it. That's crazy. When you see them walk outside with like barefoot, mm -hmm. that's some really tough thing. The side blow horn, guys, this is dope, man. Look at that. Look at this view, guys. Yeah, that's cute. That view is killer. Duh. Duh. These are the bongo drums right here. We even got some with the sticks, you know? There was like a different meaning when you said you had the sticks back then. Somebody, my 1500 self. <laughs> Let's go. Man, this is crazy. Photograph of Dows and Mombasa Old Harbor taken about 1922. Guys, I highly suggest when you come to Lamu, you check out the museum. Now you can always learn and still have fun. Make sure you check the museum out. It is full of history. Look at the styling of all these homes. How you like this view up here? It's really good. Fresh air. You can see the ocean over there. The Indian Ocean right there, man. Beautiful. <laughs> Welcome to Lamu! Woo! How do we ride the donkey? You like to ride? Are you going to kick me? I don't know. I don't know. This is different than riding the camel, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's completely different. He's like chilling with me. But I'm not doing too much. She was trying to hurt me. Alright? <laughs> me and him have a connection. No, no, no. That's it. This is fun, it's real life. It's just kind of hard to keep it balanced. This is how you get around and lie move. Ride it on. Give him a shout out. What's the name? Mommy, Mommy. Mommy, you're the greatest. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Sasa. Okay, bye bye. Hype, man. What's up, baby? I'm hype. That was amazing. Would you suggest the donkey ride to people? 100%. Yes. The ride with the donkey was amazing. I almost felt like, uh, I don't know how many times, but here I am. It was fun. It looks like. <laughs> Alright, y'all. we in the streets right now. Lamu. Recycle shop. Let's go in here. Hey, how you doing? I like this art, man. This is nice. Uh -huh. We are all the kids, the artists, they do all this work for 
from the from the center. Oh wow! So kids did this? Kids did that. Yeah. Wow, this is nice. And they can find you in Lamu. Yeah. All right, perfect, man. Asante. <laughs> Got it. All right, let's go. Let's go. Okay, what is this? How you doing? So you make clothes here? Oh wow. Nice, man. man. You can find everything here, guys. We're just going door to door. It's that Rasta vibe. This is kind of swagged out right here. I ain't gonna hold you. A lot of stuff for the ladies, it looks like. For the ladies. So you can, like, find your print right here. Asante. Look at the cat. Lamu cat. Sasa. 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 You mean think that it's money? <laughs> Old Town Art and Craft Shop. Shall we enter? Ah. Habari. What does Habari mean? Habari. It's like Sasa. So that means I should like it if it's like Sasa. Oh. oh. Uh -huh. Okay. In the book. Wow. Kenya the key of Africa. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Kenya is the key of Africa. Wow. Nice, man. You got postcards here. A lot of beautifully handcrafted wood. Name of the shop. Old Town Art and Craft. Make sure you guys check this out. This is very nice artwork. And you're the owner and you create all of this. I am the owner. This is just the open section of Lamu. This is in like the back alley part of it. So this is the part you're gonna see. That's like the main street right there, right? This is the section that you're gonna see when you walk through the alleys right here. So this is very, very dope. You're just walking through right now. Lamu Kenya, man. Hello. How you doing? Good. You can't like make this stuff up, man. What are we doing now? I said that we get on a boat. What do you say? We okay. get on the boat. You're gonna see a very nice competition, guys. So you're gonna enjoy lunch. It was 2,000 for two people. Live life, people. Live life all day. Okay, guys. So we are sailing through Lamu. Beautiful views. We even stopped at a restaurant on the water very dope and you should check it out random people got on the boat but we can't let that stop us we even had amazing views of lamu from the water you can't beat that remember guys always keep a smile and always stay positive ah, man, we got the real food right here yeah, really food amazing food come for the fisherman way okay nice guys choose one nazi this the captain right here guys Thank you. All right, man, let's eat, guys. Looks great. So after some fresh Swahili food, you lay back, relax, and enjoy the views of Lamu. Life is good. Why are you here? Yeah! Oh, shit! Let's f***ing go! Let's f***ing go get hurt now. Oh, shit, just look at you! She's looking right now, she's looking! Yo, you're lit now. No, give me some. That's how you do it. <laughs> Same outfit, different day. Here in Lamu, this is the last full day here. Currently at the Moonrise restaurant, getting the complimentary breakfast and enjoying the breeze. Listen, man, when you're in this type of weather and you could just hop outside in shorts, that is good for your body. Get the day started. Let's make it the best day. And I hope you're enjoying this vlog. Hi, it's a beautiful day. What's going on, guys, today? We are headed to Sheila Island, waiting on the captain to pick us up. And yes, sir, it is gonna be a beautiful day, people. I'm hearing Sheila Island has a different vibe than Lamu, so we're gonna see what it looks like, and they have a beach. I'm ready to put my toes in the sand and make it happen, man. So stay tuned, and let's have some fun off of the coast of Africa, baby. Woo! Life's amazing. It's the service I'm used to, people, straight up to the dock. Yes, What's up, how captain? Are you? <laughs> oh, it was good. Nobody on the boat with us. Like, this and it's crazy. clean. Yesterday was cool, but we didn't know it was going to be a joint trip. It's just good to ask whether the trip is going to have multiple people in it. We're headed to Sheila, man, so let's get to it. Headed to Sheila, baby. Woo! So excited about this. It's just us on the boat today, and it feels good. 
Yes. These are the shillings you have to pay to live life. Captain. Yes, thank you very much. Yes, sir. So how far is Sheila? 15 minutes. Okay. Taylor Swift. Why is that boat called that? I'm really happy for you. I'm gonna let you finish. But Beyonce had one of the best videos of all time. Yes. This is how they living out here, y'all. This is crazy. That's where the real money resides at, huh? So we got Sheila Bahari. Looks like a nice place just for starters, guys, to eat at. So they have lobster, calamari, lasagna, onion soup, drinks. We got a Sheila gift shop. You get shirts and pictures, things like that. So that's pretty cool. Swahili curries, grilled fish. And they got some good looking stuff on here. Swahili pizza. You're making a great couple. Thank you. Got some more donkey love. You want to go say what's up to him? Yeah. He doesn't. Nope. Yep. Don't mess with that donkey, man. You see what happens, guys? Me and the donkeys have a different life. You know what I mean? It's a little Yeah. Yeah. I respect you. Look me in the eyes. Wanna get your temperature rise. Get you on the table. I know we're on an island and we just took pictures, but I want burgers and fries, man. What do you want to eat, Akini? Swahili pizza. We'll get back to you after we find some food. Let's go. Pizza, oh, guys. Sweeter than Fanta. Mm -hmm. Sweet than my belly. Mm -hmm. I got to pie. It's nice. Uh -huh. Really nice. I have a lot of flavors in my, in my mouth. What kind of pie is it? I didn't ask them, but I feel like it's a cheese pie with a lot of sugar, sprinkles, and jelly. But it's good. Okay, guys, pizza came out and it actually looks good. It looks like it's wood fired. Let's dig in. Oh, and she's petting it. It just walked up. Guys, the pizza was crazy, by the way. This donkey is about to buck her face. <laughs> this donkey's about to buck her face, man. Oh my god. Don't do nothing to her, donkey. That ear is flickering. You better not touch that ear. It's hungry. Give him some of that pie so it could be a hyper donkey. Holy smokes. <laughs> Whoa, that donkey's about to be hyper. Cats, donkeys eating pie. This is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we're walking through right now. Pizza was good. You saw her feeding a donkey. That's what happens out here in Lamu slash Sheila, man. So how does this look? This looks beautiful, right? I want to go like, are these like rentals or like do people live here? What you think? Rentals and I think people live here. Uh, most of them are like hotels. Like Airbnbs? Yes, like Airbnb. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So these are oysters, guys. So how fresh are they? When did you catch them? Right there? Ah. Today? Okay. okay. Nice. That's what he's cracking the oyster. Yeah. Okay. Don't 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 open. Don't open it. No don't, no no. Don't, don't open. open it yet. There is hustling going around worldwide, man. Find that another time. That face is big, and if it hits you, you're done. But it's not that sad, like the ones. We have over there. Ah, she looks more curious. Like, why are you staring at me with a camera? It doesn't have those eyes like I'm about to kick your ass. Nah, she's right. chilling. She doesn't care. It looks like we're lost. No, but that's a good thing though. Lost in Lamu. That could be the title of the video. We're gonna find the beach and you're gonna find us back on here. Listen, man, this vlog is all over the place. But you know I'm gonna make it good, y'all. Let's go. That wind was kicking, guys, but that didn't stop anything. Keep smiling, keep living, and the beach was amazing. Let's go! Hoopa here is out here doing all this for you guys. You need to hit that like button. Don't forget to share and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Yeah. Guys, I know that I'm showing nothing but donkeys, but this is the donkey sanctuary, man, all right? Wow. All right, let's go. So this is Fort Jesus Fort right Jesus, here. Yeah. Wow. That's a slave, slave market. Slave market was up here. Fort Jesus. Wow, I did not know that. We got a tour guide now, guys. I'm really a tour guide. Yes, you are. What's your name? I'm good. from Lab. Good guy. Come on, let's go, man. You see? Behind of the fort. Oh, wow. The behind of the fort. So all we, of the we, slaves we, built this? Yeah. Only slaves. Mm. So from that is uh, front, here is front. Here's the back. Behind, yeah. Wow. Now we are going to the old town. Bethlehem is uh, from uh, Jesus Israel. 
Okay. Come and see. Let's go. So, are you feeling it, Kenny? Just about to see the little thing. This is the compass direction. Okay. If you get it lost, yes. you can follow the drainage. Really? Yeah. So that's how you follow where you're going? Yeah. Now we're entering for the Bethlehem. Okay. Jumbo. I don't know. I had to be serious now. How <laughs> is Bethlehem. Let's go, guys. 600 years ago, we have uh, Israel, they come here, mm -hmm. they settle, they left. Because the Israel and Arabic, they, they are not uh, good. They are enemies. Yeah. yeah. Perfect, man. Perfect. Huh? This is nice. Bethlehem. Then, uh, our buildings, we are built with the uh, mangoes. If you build with the uh, iron, mm -hmm. it's getting rust. Do people live here? What? Do people live here? <laughs> Police? <laughs> But you can you can't re renovate. You can renovate inside. Oh, this is legendary. Man. Like this is hilarious. <laughs> you said what? What? You see a street sign like this, but it's very safe. It's very like a Mombasa or Nairobi. Yes, it's safe. Security is hundred percent. Yes. Call Nairobi, Nairobi. Nairobi. Yeah. Whoa! Where the hell are we? <laughs> so the, this children. They are learning here. Oh wow. Madras is free. They learn here. They eat here. They sleep here. That's it. Now we are entering the big mosque, the Moini and the Ruth. This is crazy. This is like 360 view. Man. Look at all this. Man, that's beautiful, wow. man. Wow, man. Look at that. The last buildings. It's not far. Okay. From there. And then you can see the coconuts. Oh, come on, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And you are pushing. Okay. And you are pushing. Okay. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Hi. Wow, man, this is amazing, man. Good morning, guys. Last day in Lamu. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. About to get some breakfast. Enjoy this beautiful sunlight beaming on my melanated skin. And I hope this inspired you to take that trip that you always wanted to take. Make sure you like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment. All right, guys, until next time, stay blessed and always live life. Bye. Home. Welcome to Coop's Corner. Come along for the journey. It's a lifestyle and it's all about learning.